Praise the Lord. Today's manna is from the book of Acts chapter 9 verse number 18. Immediately something like scales fell from Saul's eyes and he could see again. Amen. After hearing from Lord Jesus Christ for 3 days Saul was blind. His physical eyes were covered by scales. When his physical eyes were closed, he started focusing on God. The end result is God opened his spiritual eyes and he saw heavenly vision. Amen. Before his spiritual eyes were opened, Saul's physical eyes were seeing him as a person who was confident on his own flesh. He was circumcised on the 8th day of people of Israel. of the tribe of Benjamin a Hebrew of Hebrews in regard to the law a Pharisee as for zeal persecuting the church as for legalistic righteousness faultless but god covered his eyes his confidence on his own flesh his background strength by scales so that god want him to see heavenly vision Once his focus moved from flesh to heavenly vision, God knows that Paul will no more live by his flesh, rather by spirit. We see God was removing scales from his vision when he received vision from heaven. Like Paul, today are we putting confidence on our own strength, on our own flesh, or are we relying on our talents, knowledge, education, family background, wealth? health job beauty then surely these things will stop us from seeing heavenly vision lord jesus to see your heavenly vision cover our eyes with scales of father as there is a blinkers or blinders on a horse stack that prevents the horse seeing to the rear and to the side like wise jesus we speak blinders to our eyes to see what you want us to see your father It's okay for us to have scales so that we can see the heavenly vision of Father. Till our self and flesh dies, do not remove the scales from our eyes, O Lord Jesus Christ. Like Paul, open our spiritual eyes. We want to see vision from heaven. We know our vision will direct us and will lead us to our destiny. Wherever scales required our in our life, cover us and show us your vision of Father. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. God bless you. Have a great day.